Hi class, I'm your virtual science helper, Mr. Frizzle, and today we're going to be talking about reflection. So, what we got here, I have myself a flashlight, I've got a mirror, and I've got my little build here. So, what we're going to do is, we're actually going to take our flashlight and we're going to see how we can actually use our mirror to redirect our light. So, first we know, when you shine a light anywhere, it shines, right? But if I put this mirror in front of the light, then we can't see it. But if we turn our mirror, we can actually see that we can manipulate the light with our mirror. And this works in all sorts of directions, guys. I can reflect it onto the bottom here. I can reflect it on here. I can even try and reflect it onto here, guys. So, what can we learn from this, guys? So, light itself, it's everywhere, except for in dark places. But if we have ourselves a mirror or a shiny surface, guys, we can actually reflect that light. We can manipulate light ourselves. It doesn't just have to shine everywhere we want it. We have ourselves a shiny surface, some aluminum foil, a mirror, maybe even some glass, guys. Even your watches that are shiny, guys, can actually reflect light and you can push that light in so many different directions, guys. We use this in so many things. Um, if you're sun tanning outside, you may see folks with those huge mirrors because they want that light to reflect all over their skin. And we also use this in film production that we do here, guys, as well. If we want to get a little bit of extra light on someone, but we don't have any extra lights, we'll just get a big, huge, shiny board, and then we'll reflect some sunlight or we'll reflect some artificial light, guys. But the manipulation of light is an amazing thing, guys. We can reflect things and we can diffuse things. But we'll get into that in another lesson, guys. Until then, I'm your virtual science helper, Mr. Frizzle. Have a great day, guys. Bye.